Hello, what do you do with the rapier sword? We have got um, the rapier sword from the Plantagenet level. Here it is, look. Now, it's quite an important object in uh, our custom dungeon. Um, and the minute you've got it, you can use it to go down the old railings level, which is there. So we need a gold key um, to do it. So, oh, 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 there's a spare bow there, there's another iron key there, there's nothing in there, of course that's welcome. So this is the trap door that goes down to the old railings level. <coughs> Don't know why I did that, we could have used the flipping rope. Never mind. Um, food. Do need some food for our sorcerer. Looks like we're pretty low on the old red stuff. I think it'd be a good idea to use the bowl to dish out some healing potion. Uh, both the sorcerer and the rat master on our party are skilled enough to do these potions but uh, as time goes on you really want to uh, upgrade the sorcerer on more skillful bowl mixing so I always find it best to let the sorcerer do them but the, in the event of him dying so what's up here then? there's nothing up here really but it's a very good idea to look around for keys. There's three keys you can get on this level. Uh, there's a prison key. And in fact, there it is now. There's the prison key, but there's also a gold key to be found. And there's a brass key, which uh, they're all pretty good. But before you jump down, just have a little look. See, we're jumping down too far. So I think it's here you can jump down. Yeah, look. So is there a key there? No. But there's a lever. So that door there, um, we're just going to open that. Oh, blimey heck. Look at this. Wow. Oh boy. Interesting. So there's another door that's locked there. You can unlock that. It's just opened. I mean, they both go to the same place. So here is a gold key. We just picked up a prison key a little while ago. Just been spotted by the skeleton commander. Uh, he's summoned some undead, we can't see them, they're behind that wall. But we're looking for a brass key a bit further down here. Uh, in fact there it is. So now we've got three keys out of that by having a little look around. Uh, there's a steel armband for somebody. What does it actually do? Protection plus one, strength plus one, we'll have that. That's interesting, there's a gold lock in there. Oh my god, there's a timepiece on the ground there, look. That is great, I love that. You get that timepiece, um, and it says things like, um, it's now noon, or... Oh look, we've got some great uh, kit here. It's a fantastic huntsman cloak. Look, evasion plus four. Oh, that's well worth having, that is. Um, they've all got kind of necklaces apart from the sorcerer. What does that actually do? Willpower plus two, lovely. I like it, I like it. Very nice too. So now we might as well go down to the beach. So using the rope this time. Here we are, we've arrived. Oh, it's lovely weather. Look at the weather. Ooh, we can climb that and... Uh, get out of these doors by using an iron key. Um, what about some food for the young lady? Yep. Now 
this here is the actual survival beach. It's a different beach to the one uh, that we started the game on. So for that reason we can pick up a little bit more food. It's always welcome. There's a lovely little cove here. Uh, this isn't the place to put the ra rapier sword. Um, actual fact. You'd think the rapier sword would go in there, wouldn't you? But it can't. But you're not far off. Right, so we want to get up to um, the action. Take this grass down. Move forward. And this is where you put the rapier sword. But the, this is actually also where the third Vilsen orb is. That was one of the Ratmaster's old mates before he went turncoat. There he is, look. Vilson Orb number three. Well sorted. Um, so we want to get through this door. This is the door that goes through to the trap door that heads down to the River of Archers, but we won't be able to get through that. Or this one, which looks like it's completely blocked by rock. So we need the Rapist Sword. Let's open the doors there. To Might as well do this one here as well. Don't leave it in the arms of those statues because uh, you need it for another one. So we are back into the blue stones. Handy to know that. Um, is there anything we want to drop off? Not really. Um, it's got a sack full of keys there. It's amazing, isn't it? All these keys. You'd think that uh, it's just overloaded with keys. Oh, he's got another key. Oh, crikey. Look at the keys. Wow. Unbelievable. That's <laughs> a card. Don't believe it. I do not believe it. Um, he's going to be able to use that soon. But I don't need all these caps to be. It's a joke. Um... Right, we go back up there. To continue our mission to get to where we want to go. It looks like a whole load of pirates have come ashore. Plundering pirates. Don't say that too loudly because we've got a rat master in the back there. And he knows these from old. But these ones have gone bad. Ooh, one of them's got a flipping gun. Ooh, 124 on that sword. Brilliant. Right, blue stuff, definitely. Right, I think we have to retreat around the corner for a second. To sort the team out, they'll probably follow us around. Um, yep, there you go, they're alright now. Should we have a little bit of a slip on that? No, I knew they'd swallow us round. It's only a matter of time. She needs some red stuff. Exit. Right, that's it, I've had enough. Right. 
Right, now maybe we can get a bit of shut eye. Ah, oh, bit vicious those pirates, weren't they? That pirates. Oh, we turn the light out. Um, what's she going to go up on now? She can go up on armour, I think. It's always good to have a bit of armour. He is going up on air magic. Um. Look at this place, eh? Look at it. Absolutely incredible. Very nice too. Oh look, we've got these reeds. God, it's a fantastic background now, I do like that. Very no oh, crikey, look at that. Top job. Wow. Incredible background. That is choice. Oh, this is gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. I've got to say, fantastic graphics. Right, can we go down to oh loads of stuff to pick up. I don't know if there's anything down here for us to find. Not sure, I don't think so. No. Nothing to be found really, so we will go on the main mission. We should go down this trapdoor. On the rope, we can have some food. Just go down hungry. So we are now in the river of archers. So there's some stones on there. You can just about see them in the dark. That's the clue. So we can jump into the river here. It's terrible in the dark. We got a lever or something down here. Yeah, there it is. It's really difficult in the dark to do this puzzle. I say, but you can't bring a light down. Really, You've got the moonlight. This puzzle is very difficult in the dark. <laughs> That's what you do. You're looking for these. There's some. There's some clue rocks here. Look, that you can just about see from the island. stage. What we're doing now is we're actually going to go to the mine. Um, there's another trapdoor around here but you can just about see the trails of the acolytes. There, she's in there, she's guarding the treasure chest. At the moment this pit is locked. All you have to do is just go here Get our eyes to light up, and the trap door is open. Easy. Shoot down to here. We are in the mine, so all we've got to do is find a button. Here it is. Look. Uh, shoot down. Uh, oh, there's another key to be had. There's a prison key to be had here. You just jump down into here. Um prison key right here. Oh God, the amount of keys we've got. Look at the amount of keys we've got. Just overflowing with them. Keys everywhere. Um, there's a useful door here, so to get it open, just head into here, place anything into there, it opens up. Um, you can shoot down a connection back to the start levels, really. This is the you know where we um, battle all the herders in here. We had a bit of a battle, and there's another secret button there that we pressed. 
I've found lots of goodies. So now we've got this little connection back to the start levels if you want to go back. So you could use that to head back to... Oh, there's a brilliant mission now. One of my favourites. That Skeleton Commander mission is superb. Definitely got to do that. This is going to be great fun. This is going to be great fun. We've got to take these guys on. So in here, there's some really good loot to be had, but you've got to know what the um, automatic defences are. There's some automatic defences in here, so basically when you go up here, um, you've got to know what the score is. So behind this wall here, um, there is like a, a magic tile here, you've got to be really careful. It's a good idea really to start down the other end so you don't cock it all up. The minute you take anything like that, the action starts. Make sure you're fully rested, otherwise they're going to take you on. You'll probably lose a couple of people if you're not watching, if you're not careful. Nothing you can do about being attacked from the sides at the moment. Flipping rough, really, isn't that? It is really. To go up. Blimey, she needs to flipping get some health. So does he. This other bloke's gone off on another tour. He's just got bored. Oh, here he comes. I mean, Minotaur's taking a pace. Here. Right, I think I think that's cleared them. So, as I said, this might be one you've got to do a few times. Oh, he's got heavy armour now. Brilliant. Absolutely, he's got heavy armour. Superb, that is really good news. Um, this guy needs to go concentration too, so they can have a rest now. Because we have got a real delicate bit to go now. Oh, we can do fireballs now. I'm pretty sure. Oh no, it's not him. He just wants food. Um, mine at all, you've got the food. So don't take anything until the very last minute. Um, so as I said, we're going to have this shield. I think the sorcerer can have it, to be honest, because there's no penalty. Look, it's just evasion plus six. That is superb for him. Um, that shield was a bit rubbish anyway, to be honest. But anyway, the minute you start. Oh, it's down the other end, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, basically you place an item in here. This flipping commander comes out. If he comes out, look, he's going to start going nuts now. Look at him. Well, I think we can do a fireball. No, we can't. Right, so what we do is we place an item on the ground and that starts off a whole load of automatic defences against him and his bloody minions. Right, 
right, so that cleared them out. But if you if you don't play it exactly right, <sighs> it, the defences can sort you out. You know what I mean? So that is a great little um, section to do if you know how it all works. But uh, 100 pellets there, look. He's always overloaded, this geezer. Always. Got to find something to improve his strength. He's, he's overloaded still. My god. Wow. Um, so the Minotaur's got a fantastic heavy weapon there, but it's heavy weapons 5. But that is absolutely top. Oh look, resurrection potion there, brilliant. Very nice too. Got some brilliant kit there, look, 100 pellets is brilliant. There's another sword there, but we've got it. So I think we picked up everything. That's really worth playing, so don't forget to do that. It's obviously optional. Don't really need to do it, but you get such a load of good kit out of there. Um, gold key here. So down here there's a bit of a secret. You place an item into there and it opens a nearby door. Right, you can actually run through these don't watch it. Um, do some really. You can actually lose somebody on that. If you're um, see, they, they're quite violent. Uh, where's the red juice gone? God, we used it all. Not quite. Um. <sighs> so we can actually, stra really strangely, we can actually just go to sleep in this bit and recover a bit. Probably a good idea to take another one of them out because. Get released at a certain stage. If you don't take them out now, they will come back to the they're, they're, they're stone summoners. I don't know what they summon. There you go, there's another one gone. Uh, we'll leave those others for the time being. They can they, they work their way free. This is where the mine key comes in because if you remember, start of the game, you found the mine key. Um, you get a really good wizard's. Really good wizard's globe down here. You do need the mine key. Um, we've got it in this bag, I think. Here we are. Look, mine key. So that opens up. It's really good. Some of that blue stuff. Food. Food. Um, shoes. I think they've all got shoes now. about her. Oh, she's got sandals. Funnily enough, I think they're both the same protection level anyway. There's a brilliant sword here. Uh, just in case you hadn't got the kind of stuff that you need. There's a two-handed sword there, but we've already got stuff. Oh, look, here's this blue... Here's this marvellous globe. This globe is an orb of radiance. When you check it out in here, the, the special attack is the light. Uh, it gives you energy plus 15, which is above what you get with this, um, not that one, this one, yeah. God, quite hungry this lot, aren't they? They are quite hungry. He's hungry. So we got that, that's worth having. I think it's at this stage that all those other stum summoners get let loose. So, might as well take the rod of those, or we could go forward. Oh, look, they're out, they're out. So, if you didn't fight them before, suddenly you're fighting them now. Okay, so 
do is shoot through straight through to the next level if we're a bit lucky just avoid the rest of them we end up in the lagoon school we did it too we did it we are in the lagoons fabuloso and the rapier sword comes in handy here as well I was going to show you that, uh, but before we do that, we just haven't got many of these red ones left. Um, it's amazing how quick you can use them. They need at least one each, really, to be honest. Yeah, they do. Right, that'll do for now. Minotaur. I can take one of these healing juices. Let's go and use the rapier sword on the next bit. There's only two areas of the game where you need the rapier sword. Um, and this particular section down here, uh, if you can offload the rapier sword down here, then why not? And then it's done. You don't need it again um, in the rest of the game. So you jump off the end there into the water. Quickly find some icons. So there's one, two, Three. This gate hasn't opened because you haven't taken them all. You need to take them all. See, so it's now open. It's now open, so you go up the ladder before you drown. Um, so be careful. So you took the four icons, and as you can see, this place is worth coming to. Uh, it's got various stuff. There's a blue one in the distance there, look. Just there. Ah. There is a guardian. Uh, where is the rapier sword now? There's the rapier sword, look. So we go down here, we can't get through there. So you place the rapier sword in the arms of the statue. Uh, on the ground there's one round key bit further on there's another one so that's two in fact you could do the round key mission just with two two keys that's all you need um, you could probably do it but uh, you've really only done half of it oh Bennett wow she's after us now I suppose Ah, cool, look at the state of them. They're not very good, are they? Um, so we got the two round keys. Ah, she didn't find us. That's something. But she is coming up to us, look. That is the Medusa. So, we could go and get some more um, round keys on the missions that are available up here. We'll do that on the next recording.